Hello guys, welcome to welcome to another Minecraft modding story. Today I'm going to teach you how to add crafting recipes to the game. So the first thing that you want to start off doing is add the new package for handlers because it's going to be a recipe handler. So recipe handler is the name of the class. And I just want to say we are in 1.8.9. The updating thing is completely the same as 1.8. So yeah, let's just add some voice. So that's register. I can't spell register. Register crafting recipes. Yeah, and we'll put this in in a sec. So public static void register furnace recipes. So once we've done that, I'm going to show you how to add recipes. So yeah. So you want to actually, I'm going to add some more methods because of other stuff that I've done. So you want to register armor piece, no register armor recipes, register armor recipe, yeah that's it. And I just want to say that I've also added a new block to the game, you know how to do that so I don't need to show you that because I've just done that for the crafting recipes. So let's actually teach how to add a recipe so the first recipe that I'm going to be doing is the one for the copper block which is like one ingot in every slot in the crafting bench so let's just do this by game registry dot add recipe you want the second one so the outputs an item stack so the output is gonna to have to be a new item stack and because it's going to be block, we want to go mod blocks dot copper block, and we can import this one as well. And the parameters is a new object, and that's just how you put it. That's just the way it works. Now you do, in fact, want some quotation marks here. So these do, in fact, the imply where it's going to be. So each item. So I want to ink it in every slot. So one, two, three. That's the top three slots. One, two, three. That's the middle three slots. And one, two, three. I'm just putting them with I because it's an ingot. You can put whatever you want in there pretty much. And you just want to press comma again and apostrophe. You want to define what I is. And it's mod items dot ingot the copper ingot. So that that's how you do that so let's add some recipes so I'm just gonna make the armor recipes now so yeah it should be quite simple so you want to take an item helmet item chest plate item leggings item boots and the item ingot here and then control shift O yep let's just copy this way of doing it so we're gonna have to put the helmet helmet here and helmet is the top three space there so space is in fact where there's no recipe so no recipe or no item there that's what space does Yeah, so that should be all of them done. So we can actually do that right now. So register armor piece, armor recipe. So it's mod items dot copper underscore helmet. Mod items dot copper underscore chest plate. Mod items dot copper underscore leggings and mod mod items dot copper underscore boot and mod items dot ingot so that's all of them now we gotta do the same for tools so it's game let's do it. I can paste it in in fact and these are going to take in all the different tools so that's an item pickaxe 
item axe, item hoe, item shovel, item sword, item ingot. So let's just change this one to the pickaxe. And pickaxe recipe is three ingots on top. And then I we're gonna have sticks, aren't we? So that's a space S space and then we, we ha we'll have to define what space what it is. And why Okay, that'll fix that. Um oops. And then that's a space S space. And we defined what the ingot is, but you want to define what the S is, so just do this. And it's actually gonna be a stick, so items dot stick. And that's for the pickaxe, so let's do it for everyone else. <laughs> so that's all the tools, so let's register these up here. So register tool recipe. So mod items dot copper underscore pick mod items dot copper underscore axe mod items dot copper underscore hoe mod items dot copper underscore shovel mod items dot copper underscore sword and mod items dot ingot so that's all of them so i'm just going to put a thing on the bottom just to say that we've registered them so system dot out dot print line notice print l n to print line and get rid of that i'm just going to say oh my gosh print line registered crafting recipes and we can just copy that for the smelting ones which I'm going to get onto in a second but first we want to actually register a shapeless recipe so shapeless registry recipes are a bit different add shapeless recipe so the output is a new item stack so the output for us is going to be the ingot so the mod items dot copper ingot but because it's going to be a block this copper block and you see it's took up three times three times three yep that in total nine ingots and we can in fact make it so there's nine ingots that come out and just put come you just put a no uh help <sighs> you just put a come It just wants me to fill this in, doesn't it? So uh, let's just fill this in first. So new object, and it's a bit different. So you just say the items that it is. So that's mod blocks dot copper block. It now will it work? Okay. Is it going to let me do it now? Comma. No. If we do that. Will it? Will it fix it? Can I put the comma now? Eclipse. Eclipse. So yeah, so it's gonna be a mod box dot that. But it might want it as an item, so I'm just gonna show you this as well. So item dot get item from block mod blocks dot copper block. So that's just gonna get us as an item. And now I can put the comma in and say that I want nine. So that's going to give me nine, and I'm also going to put another. It's done it again. Full stop. Comma. No. Comma. Slash. Comma. No. <sighs> this is really bugging me. So it's a comma. Oh my. So edit this one. Yeah. Can I put the comma in now? Comma, comma. There we go. So that's just going to say it's got no damage to it, which we're going to get onto another tutorial. So now we're going to register the furnace recipes. So it's pretty similar. 
game registry dot add smelting. So it's going to be a block input. So it's going to be mod blocks dot copper. Or the output is going to be mod items dot copper underscore ingot xp is 0 0.7 f that's because it's a float it has to be f and it wants it to be an item stack so we need to make it an item stack so that's new item stack like so and it's 0 0.7 f because that's what iron is so yeah let's go into here and register it so it is in fact in the init but it's recipe handler dot I spelt it wrong. Recipe handler dot register crafting recipes. Recipe handler dot register furnace recipes. And now we should be able to run the game. Fingers crossed, everyone. Okay, so the game is loaded up, and we can in fact see it's registered the crafting recipes. I need to change that. Uh, it's supposed to be smelting. No furnace. And yeah, so let's go test this out in my test world. Obviously, as you update this, I had to make a new world, but you know, I can't do anything about that, can I? So I do, in fact, have a block of copper. So let's open up the inventory, get a crafting table furnace. Um, so we've got to give ourselves the item. So BOE colon copper underscore ore. So we've got the ore now. Let's get a bit of the ore. Let's get some coal and should see that shove that in there, shove that in there. That's smelting. So while that's smelting, let's go turn this into nine copper ingots. Which we then can craft back up into the block and it works anywhere. Anywhere. So here, here, here. That's what shapeless recipe is like. So let's get some sticks as well. Get some sticks for some more crafting. Thank you. So let's craft ourselves a pickaxe. Yep, pickaxe. Let's craft ourselves a shovel. We can in fact move this over to this one if we wanted. If you wanted, craft it like that. Craft an axe. Just like anyway, and also if you had any eye, which I don't think is out for 1.8.9, but if you had that, it would actually display in any eye. So let's just go into survival, check these are the legitimate items. Yep, legitimate, and we also getting copper here, and we got some XP. You see on the bottom. So this will be it for today's tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed, and don't forget to like, comment, and even subscribe.